MacReview Message, MacReview DMF, and solutions based on DMF support automatic filing of emails to SharePoint using personal email filing rules. In this short video, I will show you how both your sent and received emails can be filed automatically using personal email filing rules, how you can easily define your own personal email filing rules, and how you can run filing rules across your existing emails. In my inbox, I can see I have two emails from Colin that have been automatically saved to SharePoint, marked with the yellow category. And this is where they have been saved. I'm going to go to my Mac Review tree, click on the email folder, and here is the email that we saw in my inbox previously. Let's now look at how we can manage our email rules. From the Mac Review ribbon, I'm going to choose Email Filing Rules. Here I have two rules, and the emails previously shown saved to SharePoint from Colin are doing so from this first rule here. I will now show you how to create a new filing rule for my sent emails. So I'm going to click on this tab. I'm going to add a new rule. The email rule that I'm going to create is to save all emails that I send to Colin. I will now add a new rule condition. I'm going to choose two. I'm going to enter Colin's email address. If you require any other conditions to your email rule, you simply add them using the add button. Now I'm going to choose the location that I want my emails to be saved to. Choosing this email folder and now I've got my sent rule created, emails to Colin. To ensure your new email filing rule will run, choose options, office, and I'm going to tick this option here, automatically file sent emails. I'm going to apply and choose OK. Now I will send an email to Colin to show how it will be automatically saved to SharePoint. If I now click on my sent items, I can see that the email that I've just sent has been saved to SharePoint. And now if I look in the email folder in my Mac Review tree, I can see the email that I have just sent. I have just shown how easily emails are saved as they are sent and received. However, what if you need to apply these rules retrospectively to existing emails? I will now move to my sent items and I notice that I have got some emails from Colin that have not been saved to SharePoint. I will simply select these four emails and now I want to apply the new rule that I've just created to these four emails. So from my Mac Review ribbon, I can choose Run Filing Rules. And when the emails are saved to SharePoint, the yellow category displays next to them. And when I move to the Emails folder, I can see the four emails that I have just saved to SharePoint. If you want to file emails automatically using email filing rules, you need to be saving to locations where Mac Review does not need to prompt for metadata. Prompting for metadata as emails arrive in your inbox would be disruptive. So if it needs to prompt, MacReview does not save automatically, but instead sets a blue not auto-filed category like this one in my sent items. In this video, we have seen how emails are automatically saved to SharePoint using email filing rules and how new rules can be applied to existing emails using the Run Filing Rules feature. Thank you for watching this video. For more information about Run Filing Rules and other Mac Review solutions for managing emails in SharePoint, contact Mac Review using these details.